Alright guys, prior to doing the comparison review of the Mortis Ultra and the Hantec oscilloscope uh, features, I'm actually just going to do a little unboxing and just to go see what they uh, they all send with it. So it gives you guys a good visual idea of what comes in this uh, in this kit for a price. So it does come with a nice little case, as you guys can tell. Okay, and the case comes, there's a handle onto it so you guys can carry it around. It's very portable, as you can see. The zippers actually feel very, very good quality. Doesn't I don't think that the zippers are going to break anytime soon. But, you never know, it could be, I could be wrong. So, let's get to opening it. So, of course you have the, the Handtech model. 1008B, okay. And, as I said before, it comes with a... I like to say rubber, but it feels more like a plastic than rubber on the sides. I would prefer to see this a little bit more rubberized because it just drops on the side. You know, it absorbs some of that shock. But besides that, it is very, very light. Uh, on the back of it, they also send a USB uh, driver CD. Okay. You guys, uh, you don't need this. Take this QR code right there. Scan that. Go to the website. You'll be able to download download it either on your tablet or your computer. Get the drivers and everything straight from there. So don't even put this in your in your computer. It, I don't know why they're still selling, sending it. Kind of a waste of money. If you can go just scan this and go get all your driver uh, information onto it. So. As I said before, uh, if you go on the 1008, oh, this is actually the C model. It said B when I ordered it. Huh, that's odd. Anyway, I'm going to have to write contact the seller about that one. So, right here, uh, they updated it so it actually breathes better apparently. So, it's not going to take an, uh, an overheat. Apparently this guy really doesn't take much power when you hook him up to a to a laptop or a, a tablet, so it powers up very very nicely and it hardly uses any uses anything. I haven't tried that feature yet onto it. I've only been using it on my home base PC, so we'll we'll see. That I ordered separately. And what do we have? We have a secondary ignition probe. It comes with it. It actually feels pretty good, uh, solid. Like it doesn't feel like if it would break. The heat shrink they used on this, I would rather it seem more of a plastic type instead of heat shrink, because that just looks very, very cheap. But then again, for the price, I'm not really going to complain that much. Now. On the inside, I wish I could see on the inside. I'd like to see if they actually crimped it or if they just soldered it. And from the looks of it, I think they might have just soldered it on there. So, word of advice, if you do get one, I'm going to actually open this up. Uh, not right now, but I'm going to open this up. I'm going to see if it's soldered. If it's soldered, I'm actually going to take it and I'm going to crimp it myself because I would rather have a crimp connection than a soldered connection. In my personal opinion. I could be wrong. They could have. Uh, maybe, I don't know. Very hard to tell. I don't really have anything for lighting, so. They might have crimped it. We'll see. Uh, I'll let you guys know on a later date. And. Like I said, cables and everything look very. They look durable. And it, it doesn't look like if they'll. Uh, they're not rigid, they're pretty flexible, but they feel solid, so that's always good. Nice tension on the spring that I don't think that's going to come off. That clamp could have been a little bit bigger, I think, though. Yeah. I don't know if you guys see the diameter of the clamp. I would have put that just a little bit bigger. I know that you got to try to get it as tight as you can, but you also have to make sure that it closes at the same time, so and not just throw it over it. So, that's the, the secondary current, current probe. Okay. After that, 
comes with a Type B USB. These guys you can normally find on any PCs if this one of these go. The quality of it, it, it seems good, but like, these things are very inexpensive to begin with, so the quality of it though is just like the quality of uh, the amp probe, the secondary ignition probe, sorry. And then it comes with not one or four, but eight oscilloscope uh, <clears throat> scope leads. These aren't your traditional, they come uh, with alligator clips. And let's see how these guys are connected. They're either going to be crimped or soldered. Like I said, me per personally, I'd rather crimped, but sometimes just time consuming and everything, so they'll take and they'll solder. So, like I said, on this one, on these ones, they're soldered. And you can see it. They're not crimped whatsoever. So, but the quality of the cables look uh, a decent quality. They look, it doesn't look like it's like going to break very easily. I'm pretty sure that they could take a beating. They're... All right. And after that, well, that's pretty much it that comes with the kit. So, back to the little module. We have a channel, an automotive. I've never seen anybody use a channel, but for the price, you get an eight channel oscilloscope. Might as well go for it. And here's uh, channel seven and eight. Now they do have a secondary plug, which I haven't been able to find. I looked uh, on Amazon and everything, but I haven't been able to find it yet. It's this little guy right here. This guy. Now on this one, it has a bunch of grounds, it has a bunch of our little connector, it has a, a voltage onto it also. A voltage output. And you have a constant ground terminal that's right here. Or it needs to be grounded, I haven't quite figured that one out yet. It might need to be grounded or it's an internal ground. And also you got a signal generator right here. It says programmable, but I don't know if it is. We're gonna after I boot up the software, we'll we'll see what happens. And that's pretty much it. So that's all there is on the unboxing of the Handtech itself. And this is a, they say it's the one zero zero eight C. I'm gonna recheck that because I had ordered the one zero zero eight B. So they might have sent me the wrong one, but we'll see. Where to seize the updated version? I really don't know. I just seen it. The price was good. Decided to order it. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.